Let's go, crazy donkey. You want some of this, huh? What a grind everybody, yes it's me, it's Mephius, back again to play some games, I haven't played some games in a while, and uh, yeah in this video I'm going to be returning back to Lies of P, I had a little try of it uh, at the end of last year, and uh, I was hearing some really good things about it, people saying that this was their game of the year, as in last year, um, so I thought, you know what, I wasn't going to do any more videos on it, but I think I'll give it a good try. Uh, I really love the blood blog. I'm hoping I'm going to love this the same way. Um, so yeah, let's do this. Okay, then. So we're back uh, to Lies of P. Uh, now I did actually play a little bit of this off video. I got to this hotel and I actually got the intro sequence. So I hadn't even got to the title sequence uh, when I played it last. Um, so now I've made it to the hotel. I've met the lady that was speaking to me. Um, and I also got a cool outfit. Um, so I'm rocking my uh, Willy Wonka at the moment. Uh, let's see. What's her name? I'll use my power to help oh, you. Oh, Sophia. Ah, so she can level me up. Um, let's talk to her a bit first, though. Ergo is the miracle that made Krat prosper. Without Ergo, there would be no automated puppets to make Krat wealthy. When you move, you tap into the power of Ergo within you. Gather more Ergo. It will make you stronger. In the folklore of Krat, a cricket often acts as a guide. That is why these automated models became popular. But Gemini is unique. He's more than just a guide. As you get more familiar with Gemini, you'll see what I mean. Okay. Alright. Now, what can we level up? I think I'm gonna go with that. A bit of health, a bit of capacity. Let's level that up. So hopefully I can um, sort of mine some of this stuff as I go along. All right, got a dude here. Can we talk to him? Welcome to Hotel Crop. My name is Polandina, butler to Lady Antonia. Please let me know how I may be of service. At Hotel Crot, comfort and calm walk hand in hand. Welcome to Hotel Crot. How may I be of service? Hmm. What can we purchase? I really don't know what any of these things are, to be honest, so... Oh, okay, so I can obtain ego by smashing these. This must be like permanent stuff I can carry around with me. Um, do I use that now? Does that make sense to use it now? Even small pieces can put to good use in the sea. Came from the Parade Master. It's packed with immense power. Treasure Hunter may want this rare ego. Uh, or ergo, that entire audience disappeared in a pool of blood. The rape master was cheerful, as long as that it's a king to show them. Let's, let's go on. So, right, okay, so that uses up ego. And then I can use that also. Whoa, okay, there's a lot of ego. So now I can I'll use level my up power some more. to help you. Okay, so yep, yeah, got my stats all good. 
think. I hope that was uh, the right move. So this month's attraction, Hotel Karat. Hotel Karat is one of the city's creepiest and most mysterious buildings, according to lore. Hotel Karat is an isolated castle built by an aristocrat devoted to a form of occultism. After receiving a revelation from a radiant tree, at one point it was used as a mental institute and some patients said they saw hallucinations. However, no record remains as they were all destroyed in a large fire. Above all, being so far underground just compounds the rumours. Some even said that it is connected to an unknown hell. But now the rumours have served to embellish the charm of Hotel Karat, which has been renovated in the, la in the latest style. As the recent rumours of the Grand Exhibition Ghost Hotel spread, most customers are actually looking to stay at the hotel. Next is a comment from the hotel owner, Miss Anantonia. Ghost Hotel? I've heard that more times than I can remember, but fortunately our hotel guests are brave, like lions. It's not a problem at all. Rating 4 out of 5, creepy and mysterious, best resort in Krat, a friend of the city. Okay. Oh! Uh, oh, hello. Unexpected guests. And Antonia. We don't insist on reservations. I am Antonia, and this is my hotel. Welcome. Oh, I knew from the moment we met the Georgia Petto's puppet. He might have We're a few bloodborne vibes. Petto's skills are undiminished. It's a shame. He took off for Elysian Boulevard. And he never came back. If it doesn't turn up soon, we'll have to make a new coffin. <laughs> oh, I forgot. I was keeping this for him. It comes with a long story. But I think it's better off with you. Please find that old man. And do take care of yourself out there. Ooh. Give me new gear. I don't know, man. It's kind of whack in comparison to... Um... that gear. I'm going to stick with that gear. People have no idea so many secrets are buried in crap. Thanks for keeping me company. What are you curious about? I see you're here. That means you can lie. Your lives are a rare ability. You're able to choose your own path, unbound by anything. People on the outside are still afraid of puppets. Lie to protect yourself and find your path. Lying is bad. I'm an old friend of Geppetto's. His son is like family to me. Make yourself at home. You're always welcome here at the hotel. If you have any questions, ask my butler, Polandina. Investigate. I can play the piano. I feel like that might come into play at some point later, but we'll see. Nice. 
Ooh, more people to talk to? I heard about you from Geppetto, but to see you in person... Wow! You should take this. Geppetto left it with me. What is it? Yo, dude. Is this a grapple hook? <sighs> the sound of it alone. That craftsmanship comes only from the hands of Geppetto. You must be something else. A custom arm from Geppetto himself is quite an accessory. Oh, I forgot to introduce myself. I am Eugenie from the Workshop Union. I know my way around weapons of all kinds. I'm sure Master Geppetto would agree. If any of your weapons need work, bring them to me. Okay. Just got some cats. Right. I don't know enough about the handles yet. If you want to test your skills or try new techniques, head for the garden. The stalkers captured a puppet to use for training. Don't look at me like that. Everyone hates puppets. I know whose side you're on. A stargazer is a survival device used by the stalkers. It powers itself by accumulating and absorbing ergo spores in the air. The stalkers installed stargazers all across the city. Once they're recovered, we can put them to use. Okie dokie. Okay, uh, let's have a look upstairs. Anything upstairs? Alright, so we need the street key for that. Right then, so I guess we are going back outside. Can I walk in this? Okay, Jiminy, let's, um, let's go talk. Prepare stargazer. Your friendly puppet guide. Or friendly guide puppet? I don't know, one of those. I'm also a friend of Sophia's. Last time I woke up, Sophia was there because... Because she woke me up. But I'm sure there are still other memories in there. Sorry. Must be the shock. Bear with me, and I'll do my best to guide you. Um... Yep, let's go exploring. Oh, it says you use left arm. Ah, I can drag it. Oh, 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 oh. Hold on a minute. Right, so I can pull enemies towards me, which is cool. Right, let's have a look what's going on down here. Whoa, you sneaky. Where'd he 
come from? Punk. Throwing cell. Man. Proper sucker punch me. Elysian Boulevard was a regular rich people row. You wanted fancy boutiques and shops. <laughs> no place better. But that was long ago. Before the puppet frenzy. Is this a shortcut? Oh, okay. So that I can't press yet. Uh, so maybe I need to do that from the other side somehow. Oh. Now, can I use my little strike? Let's get away from the guy with the gun. Ooh, we have a box. in the menu okay so let's have a look at this this is a defensive item ah, okay so I've got the light frame one this is physical damage reduced rate okay physical damage reduced rate so that reduces it quite a lot but puts my weight up okay um, I think I've got the right one equipped let me stick with that Seems all right. Um, Jesus. Oh my god. Okay, gonna have to heal up. Didn't want to do it, but it's gonna have to be done. Look at this guy, ready to shoot me. Uh oh, I've messed up. Oh, did that damage me? Ah, seen you this time, punk. So, get ready for the sneak attack here. Ah, this is what I saw in the pause screen. Aha, so now I've got a shortcut up here. 
Um, Seems like a different type. drops there. Um, I'm definitely going to have to go back to the Stargazer because I haven't got enough hold for this. Do I do that? Do I continue to explore? Puppet string is actually damaged. Okay, I didn't realise I could get damaged. Maybe I shouldn't use it that much. Sneaky. I'm going to end up getting killed here, so I'm going to have to go back. There's no choice. Now, presumably, presumably, there is no fall damage, but I'm not 100% <laughs> sure. Yep, there's fall damage. <laughs> Is this where I can reclaim my stuff? Aha! Got my deaf ego back. Alright, so we get this hardcore dude, comes out of here. Um, where is he? Is he a boss? boss because he didn't reappear this time so that's interesting this guy he's over there so can I run across without getting hurt haha <laughs> you freaking punk knew it I blocked as well sharp pipe Who's talking? Sharp pipe, is that a weapon? Mm, no, usable item. Sharp pipe could be thrown. 
passes through enemies and inflicts piercing damage. Some throwable weapons boost great destructive power on their own. When combined with the strength of the puppets, nothing is more to be said. Interesting. Alright, be real careful now. Take it nice and easy. Didn't like that at all. Electric blitz. Let's have a look at that. Let's go down. Ah, so this is my shortcut. Excellent. So that means boss time. Must be right. Through the shortcut door and then up the ladder. Best time is for the. Uh... What was that? Electric shock. You cheeky. All right, I can't do anything about that guy yet. messed up in this section. Might have to do a rerun of this at some point. Um, Continue on past here. There was ladders. Okay, he's a big guy. I'm gonna come back to him. A letter. My Louise and Charlotte's treasure. Can't hear anything. I think the streets are already dead. Nothing but silence. I assume that I too will become just another perforated corpse soon. So
freaking guys, because that would be great if we could. Doesn't look like it though. Um, okay, let's drop down. God. Right. This is not going to go well. Is this worth using the throwing? Let's give it a try. Oh, that didn't do much damage at all. Right. Don't want to get stuck in a small room like that. Amulet. Okay, what does that do? Um, life Amulet increases maximum HP. An amulet that can be equipped on a puppet. Information and memories are useful for movement. Can be imprinted on symbols to draw out special powers. Equip it, please. Let's go. Okay. Alright, so HP is good. I do believe this is a stargazer. So we can talk to That's how it was. Why, hello! <laughs> I didn't know anyone was alive out here. <laughs> I know what you're thinking, but I'm not a burglar. <laughs> I'm just crashing in an abandoned house for a while. Don't worry, I won't cause any trouble. We survivors need to look out for each other. Uh, for your information, I didn't steal this. Okay, what are you selling? Electric coil stick handle for a sword. That could be pretty cool. Let's buy that. Right, so this is locked off. I can't touch that yet. Okay, let's keep that there, but we'll do that as my secondary weapon.
you absolute until I can figure out how to get back up. It's with these guys. Is that something I can throw stuff at to trigger? Maybe. going on here. I think I need to focus on getting back to the Stargazer. I go out there, that guy's going to shoot me. Um, so I need to take care of him first. Didn't he go? 
together. Okay, let it go. Talking. Oh, you can talk. Ah, very blood bored. Okay. Who is it? Is that you, Murphy? Oh, I guess not. Sorry, I, I thought you were my friend, Murphy. Well, Alex Murphy. Murphy? Is a super cool police officer. <clears throat> As a puppet, even the petrification disease can't get him. I wish I was like him. <clears throat> You should leave so you don't catch the disease from me. I wonder if that is a nod to Alex Murphy. That'd be cool. Uh, right, so let's... Can I trigger this? Shop Union Standard Insulation Converter. Okay. What does that do? Oh. Taking damage. Cell. I wonder what that is. I wonder if it's like a grenade or something. Right then. I guess we're heading back up. Um, should head back up this way. Wanting to do something there. See you. To follow that? Right. Let me grab this first. Hidden moonstone. Occasionally a dimensional butterfly will appear in parts of Krat. Monad's lamp can detect the butterfly, lighting up red to point out its location. When the character is near the hiding butterfly, it will appear. After a certain amount of time, the butterfly will disappear into another dimension. Kill it to get useful materials. Okay. Voice. Where's that coming from? Oh, this looks uh, suspicious. It's another boss area. Oh, I can see someone in that window. Oh, shit. 
shit. All right, this guy's on it immediately. That's the wrong button. Huh? You fucking punk. Oh, I got a new weapon. What was that? I just picked up. Karat police button. Ooh. Okay. Let's give that a try. Oh my god, that's well small. But maybe you can do a combination with that thing. This must be your first time in the petrification disease quarantine zone. For most people, this is their last stop. You are a good Samaritan for coming all the way here. I want. May I ask you a favor? My family took my baby from me and sent me here. They said it was for my own good. But it was heartless, just the same. A baby must be with its mother. Please go to Karat City Hall and bring me my baby. Karat City Hall. Okay, yeah, I'll help. Thank you so much, kind one. I can finally see my sweet Elena's face again. Please hurry. Heart scales spreading across my eyes. Before uh, I lose my sight. Please. She said the baby was at City Hall. Should we check it out? I hope everybody's safe. It itches. Peel the skin. And there's blue blood. Blood, blood, pretty cocoon, blue angel, joyful appetite, blue death, what a feast, death, death, and death. I'm alive, itches. <laughs> it's not quite itchy, scratchy, tasty, scratchy, or whatever it was from Resident Evil, but. Keep forgetting about the grapple hook. You want some of this too, huh? Oh, I not expecting that. A 
location removes attribute status. Okay. Ah, a shortcut. So I know that area. That's that's a shortcut there. This guy again. Probably shouldn't waste on that guy. Ho ho ho! Two hits. Yeah, boy. Right, so we got there. Right, I suspect this is Probably going to lead to the boss fight. Have I got a key for it though? Right, I'm not going that way yet. I'll come back. Let's just have a look here first. Let's see what's. Repair. Ah, lift, okay. This guy. Uh, for your information, I didn't steal this. Ah, oh, that's the bind selling guy. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Uh, so I think this is my chance to upgrade. All right, see, back down the elevator. Shit, these guys are back. Right, I'm just gonna ignore them. Let's head this way. Oh, Come out, Geppetto! You've got a lot to answer for! Who's this guy? You know what caused the puppet frenzy, don't you? You're their maker, practically their father! You and the alchemist scheming together. Tell me the truth! What's your problem? I'm here for the old man, get lost. Wait, I know you. Or well, more like I know what you are. You're the devil's puppet. You can't sneak past me. Let's go, crazy donkey. You want some of this, huh? I'll give you both, then string you up on the bridge. Oh, ho, ho. wasn't too bad. It wasn't too bad. Compared to that first boss, that was ridiculous. 
This is Chipotle. Finally, we meet, son. It's a dream come true, seeing you like this. I understand why some people despise me. I invented the puppets after all. I should take responsibility as their maker. But in order for me to do that, I need to take care of the puppets at City Hall. Won't you help me, son? Take this. You'll find it most useful. Ooh, new outfit. Mad Donkey hunting arrow. I want to hear all about your experiences. But now isn't a good time. Use the stalker's key to open the bridge door. Then get rid of the frenzied puppets that have seized City Hall. Ah, we'll catch up baby. at Hotel Cry when you're done. Okay, Dad. Right. I mean, shall I have a look at that outfit? I'm sure it's going to be pretty whack, but... Uh, Mad Donkey. Maybe without the donkey head. Let's try this look out a little bit. Alright, so I should have the key now. Yes. Let's see more. Karat City Hall. There we go. Assemble weapons now. Right then, guys. Well, that was Liza P. Um, yeah, I'm loving. I'm loving the game so far. It's uh, not too challenging yet. I'm sure it's going to get worse, <laughs> uh, but um, it's pretty fun. I, I like I like the different mechanics. Now I get to play around with different weapons configurations, um, so that could be fun. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, please like, hit the notification bell, and subscribe. I'll see you next time.